Hi, this is Tracy Fabian with KPI Online, and welcome to a short overview video on the collection of revenue dashboards. When you first decided to sign up for access to KPI Online, I'm betting you wanted or you needed a better understanding of your revenue. You probably thought, hey, wouldn't it be great to see how revenue has performed over the last few months? Or maybe you just wanted to see who your top customers were or what products were bringing in the most dollars. The collection of KPI Online Revenue Dashboards will do all of these things for you and more. When clicking on Revenue from the main dashboard, you will be taken to the Revenue Trends Dashboard. Here you can quickly see a 12-month trend graph detailing the performance of revenue, cost of sales, gross profit, and gross margin over the last 12 months. From this graph, you can easily determine the best and worst month or quarter of performance. By hovering over the bar or a line graph, you can get the exact dollar amount for that individual metric. At the bottom of this dashboard, you see a six-month variation on revenue and gross margin based on regions. These are quick visual indicators to let you know whether revenue and gross margin had either increased or decreased based on the previous month. By hovering over the visual indicator, you can see the exact dollar amount that you've either increased or decreased. There are three additional dashboards in the revenue collection. Let's first look at the top 15 customers dashboard. Here you can quickly view the top 15 customers and key financial statistics for each of those customers. Use the dimension filters near the top of your window to narrow the focus of the data. Let's say you only wanted to see the top 15 customers for just your computer items. Use the product category dimension filter to do this. Even better, you can drill down right here within this table. Let's look at the product categories our top customer has purchased from. Click on the customer name and go to dimensions, product, and product category. The table will update and now we're looking at the product categories that our top customer has purchased from. You can continue drilling down right here in the table or you can click on the blue border to restore the table to the original format. Very similar to the top 15 customers dashboard is the top 15 products dashboard. Here you can quickly determine which product is bringing in the most revenue. And don't forget to use the dimension filters as well to narrow the focus of the results. Lastly, we have the sales executive analysis dashboard. This dashboard gives you a quick glimpse into the performance of your sales executive. The table in the top left hand corner displays a breakdown of revenue, gross margin, and average price statistics based on individual sales executive. On the right hand side you see a two dimensional bubble chart comparing revenue and gross margin. By hovering over a particular bubble you can see which sales executive and then the precise data for those statistics. In the bottom right hand corner you see a breakdown of revenue by product category. By clicking on a sales executive name in the left hand table, the product category table in the bottom right will be updated to reflect data for that specific sales executive. All of the dashboards in the revenue collection have been designed to provide you with quick visuals on how key revenue statistics are performing. For assistance or if you have any questions using KPI Online, please click the live support icon in the upper right hand corner of the dashboards or feel free to send us an email at support at kpionline.com. Thank you.